Invasive species are a growing concern in Ontario and valley lands are unfortunately quite vulnerable to their establishment as well as being a major conduit for dispersal. While rivers in southern Ontario are routinely surveyed, there is a very poor understanding of the degree to which invasives are altering valley lands. Valley lands can also support species that are known to have specific habitat requirements. When observed, the presence of these rare species is an indicator of the presence of healthy habitats. This module evolved as a means to enable surveyors to begin to document which of these tract species occur and where they occur so that we can begin to understand their spatial distribution in river valleys. Isn't that an Acadian flycatcher? Yes, that sounds like they're tall. Is it on the paper there? It is. I'll mark that one off. This is a rapid assessment module. It is intended to enable users to document the presence of species that they are confident in their ability to identify. It will involve minimal extra effort and can be done while they are working at a site applying other modules. The module evolved through a collaboration between groups with a mandate to track these species and stream practitioners. As a rapid assessment tool, it is not expected that all species will be identified at any one location. Rather, Surveyors will apply varying levels of effort depending on the study objectives and the surveyor's identification skills. What is unique about this module is that it can include both terrestrial and aquatic species. It can be carried out in concert with any other OSAP module and combines the desire to document both invasive and indicator species. I think these might be invasive, Jeff. They might be. What do you think they are? I'm not entirely sure, but... Maybe a Chinese mystery snail? It might be, but I don't know either. We better take a sample of that. Is it on the list? Um, yes, there's Chinese mystery snail. Well, why don't you mark it down as a suspected and we'll take a voucher. Okay. You can go back to the lab and verify it. Sounds good. Surveyors must document only species that they are confident in identifying. And if there is any doubt, voucher specimens or photos should be taken. If there is only one invasive species observed on site, you may consider using the mobile app EdMaps Ontario. You would use this module whenever you visit a site to apply any other OSAP module. What will vary is the amount of time spent looking for particular species of interest. For example, a suspected range expansion in an area might be a justification for spending extra time to conduct a targeted survey to look for that species. Surveyors must also ensure that they do not become a vector for transporting invasive species, especially by carrying seeds, soil, or plant fragments to other locations. Be sure to check your boots, waders, and other survey equipment for seeds, mud, or plant fragments.